volume of prisms example one and we're going to calculate the volume of this prism here which is a rectangular prism okay now I mentioned earlier that you really need to find the area of the base now when I say base it doesn't necessarily have to be the part that's sitting on the ground for instance with this shape I'm actually going to select the base to be this side part on the rectangular prism okay and then we've got to find the height now the height in this case is 10 and it's very important that whatever you pick for the height must be lines that are parallel to each other for instance we've got three lines this one this one and this one and they are all parallel so we know that this is going to work quite fine all right so we'll start by finding the area and the area of this part here is four times six or 24 centimeters squared and with that we can find our volume by going area times height or 24 times 10 giving us 240 and this time it's centimeters cubed since it's volume 